Mancala. Mancala is all about planting. Like seeds? Oh, I see. You pick up the seeds and drop them in their little holes. You get to choose which of your pockets to move stones from. And these six pockets are mine? Yeah. The goal is to collect the most stones in your store. Sure, in case of famine. There's one other twist you should know. Yeah? If you drop your last stone in an empty pocket, it's capturing time. You can take your opponent's seeds. Nice. The game ends when one player runs out of stones in their pockets. So whoever has the most seeds in their store survives the winter. I mean, wins the game. How does it all work, you ask? We'll figure it out as we go. Said the grasshopper to the ant. Sure.
capture. Capture. Bats and boxes. Ever played this one before? Don't think so. Where's the board? All you need for this one is a pen and paper. That's it? <laughs> so I take it the rules aren't too complicated. There are basically just two. On your turn, you draw a line. When your line finishes a box, you get a point. Two rules for a 2D game. I'll give it a shot. What just happened? Oh, right. If you finish a box, you get to keep a third dimension.
four in a row. Have you come to try and get four in a row before me? Token drop block! Falling circle counter! Crouching disc stance! Seeds of future victory! Hidden path strike! I'm so close. You fought. We will duel again in winter. Hit and blow. Oh, what's all this? It's a game where you guess at a set of hidden pegs. Oh, fun. Here's how it works. A brown peg means you have the right color in the right spot, like a direct hit. With you so far. A white peg means you've got the right color, but in the wrong place, or a glancing blow. So this means you have all four colors right, but only two are in the right place. Exactly. Let's assume red's in the right spot. What happens if I try this? Does that tell us anything? Um, well, what if I switch them around like so? <sighs> I don't understand. This is taking forever. Let me try. 
I think you were on to something with that red one. Blue's obviously one of the bottom two, so let's put it here. But we have to make a change somewhere, so I'll swap purple and white. And voila! <laughs> Not bad, right? Oh, uh, way to learn from my mistakes. Zero hits, two blows. Zero hits, three blows. One hit, three blows. One hit, three blows. Hare and Hounds. Mm, look at the animals! Cute! <laughs> it's not as cute as it looks. The hare is trying to escape the hunting hounds and get to the other side. Hounds win by blocking the hare's escape route. Aww, poor bunny. It's all alone against three dogs. 
I wouldn't count the hair out just yet. Only one hound can move on their turn, and the hounds can't move backward, while the hare can go wherever it wants. It's actually pretty tough for the hounds to catch. Mm, poor doggies! Now you're on their side? Air hockey. I don't need to explain anything here, do I? 
know, but you're going to anyway. If you put your face right up against the table, the air coming out of it is really refreshing. Okay, now we need next. Renegade. Oh, I know this game. We have a long and troubled history. Really? All you gotta do is flip your opponent's pieces by placing yours on either side. I know, but it feels like I always end up losing at the last minute. Huh. Are you securing the corners? The corners? Why? Ah, see, if you take all four corners, you can flip the script on your opponent. <laughs> oh, all right, Renegade. You have no more power over me. Thank you. 
speed. Speed! Speed! Dealing! High or low? Ready? Go! Whoa, a wide open field. No one's touched it. That's where we come in. My road's gonna stretch from there to there. Uh-uh, I'm gonna get from here to here. Wow, we're gonna... Yeah, but I'll ruin you f Quit blocking my road! Why? That's the whole get. Almost there! Help! Unauthorized building! Block the bulldozers! Yeah! Looks like I...
drafts. It's slow going, moving one diagonal space at a time. Then I jump to capture you, and it's all for nothing. Oh. I'll capture all your pieces before you know it. Not if I can reach the other side and get kinged. That's a verb now. Wow, king pieces get to move backward too. Royal privilege is hard won, but sweet. King me. King me. 